Today I'm going to tell you another story of Panchatantra and today's story is titled The Singing Donkey. Once upon a time lived a laundry man in a village. He had a donkey named Kalu. Kalu used to work hard all day and night but he never got enough food to satisfy his hunger. The laundry man didn't intentionally give less food to Kalu. He was poverty stricken due to which he couldn't afford more food for him. Because of his inappropriate diet, Kalu was getting weaker day by day. One day, the laundry man succeeded in finding a way to properly feed Kalu. The laundry man decided to leave Kalu in open during night so that he can fetch food from the nearby villages. He thought this way Kalu will be able to feed himself properly. One night, when Kalu was hovering in the farms, he met a jackal named Papu. Both of them then began to visit multiple farms in the villages every night. They ate grass, pumpkins and green vegetables. They got used to having dollops of fun in the farms of the villagers. Papu, tonight feels like heaven. I am willing to sing a song under the moonlight. Papu flipped out listening to this quest of Kalu and said, Have you lost your senses, brother? Are you really planning on doing Dhenchu Dhenchu at this time of night and wake up the landlord? It's not the right time to sing. Why is this not the right time? That is because the landlord will go crazy listening to your irritating voice and he will beat us both with a stick. Nothing will happen, mate. You are worrying for no reason. Do you know how many people love my voice? People used to rave about my singing skills during my childhood. God knows who raved about your singing. Papu continued trying to convince Kalu. Kalu, your voice isn't good. Listen to me. Drop the idea of singing or else both of us will be in deep trouble. What do you know about singing? I am a very good singer. I am definitely going to sing tonight. No one can stop me from doing it. Okay, if you want to sing, then do it. But first let me get away from her. Kalu laughed on the request of Papu and said, Ha ha, okay, you can go. You aren't worthy of my friendship. As soon as Papu left, Kalu began to sing a song. <laughs> Listening to Kalu's annoying voice, the landlord came running towards him with a thick rod and beat him badly. Kalu screamed out loud but no one came to save him. Somehow, Kalu managed to run and save himself from the landlord and he met Papu on the outskirt of the farm. Seeing Kalu, Papu said to him, Kalu, I told you so many times not to sing, but you didn't listen. Had you listened to me, you wouldn't have suffered so much. Kalu felt ashamed of himself and said, You are right, my friend. I ignore your advice, which is why I am now in this situation. So kids, from this story, we learn a lesson that we must always consider a good advice. If you enjoyed this video, do like, share and comment. And to be the first person to watch our videos, make sure to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for timely notifications.